Bennett and Black spring game. And your impressions, Matt Stinchcomb, of the soon-to-be junior quarterback. Well, I thought he looked really comfortable in what they were trying to get accomplished offensively, and he should because this offense is tailored around his personality. They want to be aggressive. So does Jake Bentley. And you talk to Will Muschamp, the offensive staff, they think that he performs best when they're playing at a pace. And right now, that's what they're going to emphasize. Or Rutledge and coach Will Muschamp. Coach, you were able to do some situational things and a lot of game-like things in the spring game. How did they handle that? I thought they handled it extremely well, but that's the way we practice all the time. We've got a purpose of what we do at practice, whether it's a first and ten, move the ball, a red zone, a one-minute situation, uh, third down. So our guys are used. We've, we've been a pretty good situational team. You wanted a lot of offense, total of 54 points scored. How did that side of the ball look to you? Well, I thought very efficient, uh, throwing the ball, especially with the first group. We had too many drops. Uh, we had some probably some if he if he had gotten the ball off situations, which I normally favor the offense in the spring. So, uh, but I, I was pleased with the day. I thought our guys came out focused. We had a lot more action and accountability than talk, and that's good for us. Other than Jake Bentley, because we talked about him, what did you see from other quarterbacks on this team? Well, Michael Skarnick is our backup. I mean, he throws the ball extremely well. Uh, he, I think he's sped his game up since we've been here uh, from the first year to where he is right now. But I feel very confident in him right now. And then we have two really good young quarterbacks coming. How about the defense? Couple turnovers, interceptions. What did they show you? Well, again, we're, we got to get the ball off people and be opportunistic, get the ball back to our offense, which I think we can be really efficient offensively. But we still have some room to grow, especially on the back end. Maybe the biggest throw of the game was Garnecki is to Spurrier didn't come through. I mean, what will you tell the young man about that opportunity? I just got to look it in. Can't blame the sun. Uh, we're taking a shot. We're going to be aggressive. Okay, and you've got two more practices. Anything specific that you'll work on with them? Oh, absolutely. Our young offense and defensive linemen, they're going to get all the work. I mean, I know what a lot of these guys could do. We're going in our third year, and we've had our first and second year guys play a lot of football for us. So we've got to get better on both lines of scrimmage. Thanks, Coach. All right. Thank you, Laura. South Carolina opens up at home against Coastal Carolina September 1st, then the big one September 8th against Georgia here in Columbia. So long.